Assalamu alaikum guys, welcome back to Civil Engineers YouTube channel. Guys, I have started a new uh, YouTube channel related with civil engineering videos uh, in Urdu language because uh, many Urdu language students, they were telling me that sir, uh, start a video in Urdu. So therefore, uh, my new channel name is Civil Students and the link is in the description of this video. Guys, if you want Urdu mein videos chahiye, civil engineering related, तो मैंने एक नया चैनल शुरू किया है जिसका नाम है सेवर स्टूडेंट्स और इस वीडियो के डिस्क्रिप्शन में लिंक है आप उस लिंक पर क्लिक करें और उस चैनल को भी जरूर सब्सक्राइब करें नाम है उस चैनल का सेवर स्टूडेंट्स जहां पर मैं उर्दू में इंशाल्लाह वीडियोस अपलोड करूंगा बहुत बहुत सारे वीडियोस है उधर आप जा सकते उधर और सब्सक्राइब कर सकते हैं गाइस टुडे आवर टॉपिक इज एसबीसी व्हाट इज एसबीसी safe bearing capacity of soil that's why i selected this topic for today because uh, last night i uploaded some uh, some captions uh, for uh, you people uh, to out for different types of lectures and the first lecture uh, were there uh, st uh, uh, steel structure the second one uh, plinth beam design the third one uh, footing design the fourth one sbc what is safe bearing capacity of soil okay so uh, at morning time when i see uh, my laptop so there were more wood pulled for sbc topic safe bearing capacity of soil so therefore today we will discuss because uh, safe bearing capacity of soil is very important uh, to know about this because uh, before starting building construction we have to check uh, SBC safe bearing capacity of soil because we have different types of soil and different types of soil has different safe bearing capacity so therefore to find depth of foundation uh, and uh, uh, from uh, shear failure and settlement okay uh, so you should uh, check the soil investigation report so let's start guys if this video is helpful for you safe bearing capacity of uh, safe bearing capacity of soil so you should like this video for my motivation and subscribe the channel with press bell icon let's start new channel several students link is in the description of this video or go to my main channel this one so there is several students you can subscribe it okay the topic is guys safe bearing capacity what is safe bearing capacity of soil okay safe bearing capacity of soil okay the simple definition of safe bearing capacity of the soil is okay that is the capacity of soil which support which support the structure load to the soil without any shear failure or settlement this is the simple definition of safe bearing capacity or an interview they can ask from you uh, what you think about SBC safe bearing capacity of soil so it means the capacity of the soil which support the structure load to the soil without any shear failure or settlement this is called safe bearing capacity and safe bearing capacity uh, of the soil is depend on the different types of soil and different types of soil is also depend on the different location so before starting building construction you have to check soil investigation report otherwise you will face more problem if you don't know the safe bearing capacity of soil right now guys we have different types of soil as i told you okay now uh, safe bearing capacity safe bearing capacity for different soil okay so the first uh, column I will write are uh, types of soil. Types of soil. And the second bearing capacity of soil in kg per meter square. And third bearing capacity of soil 
and kilonewton per meter square. So guys, you can see here, for example, this is a column and this is footing. When the load comes on the column, okay, same like this. Okay, so here guys, this is called this one, the opposite direction. Okay, this is called bearing capacity. bearing capacity of soil if this bearing capacity of soil is not safe so the structure will be fail due to shear failure or settlement okay the safe bearing capacity of soil should be okay if the bearing capacity of the soil is low and structure load is more so the structure will be fail if the uh, structure load is less than its safe bearing capacity so the structure will be safe so therefore the soil investigation is very important to check before starting any building construction right now guys we have different types of soil different types of soil has different bearing capacity and different bearing capacity of the soil is also different on the different location because in different location we have different types of soil okay so guys we have different types of soil so the first one we have soft and wet wet or muddy clay which bearing capacity is 5000 kg per meter square because bearing capacity of the soil uh, unit is that is kg per meter square because this is uh, force okay on the or pressure on the area okay or kilonewton per meter square okay now here uh, 50 kilonewton per meter square in bearing capacity in kilonewton 50 kilonewton per meter square and in kg 5000 kg per meter square for soft or wet or muddy clay okay second one is soft clay okay this is soft clay which is this is just soft clay okay not muddy or wet so uh, that is one uh, ten thousand kg per meter square and here 100 kilonewton per meter square right the third one is guys fine loose loose and dry here dry sand okay fine loose and dry sand that is also one thousand ten thousand kg per meter square or 100 kilonewton per meter square this is the other type because different types different types of soil different uh, safe bearing capacity okay black cotton soil is black cotton soil that is 15,000 kg per meter square and here 150 kilonewton okay per meter square the other one is moist glay moist glay or uh, sand glay okay sand glay moist okay that is same 15,000 kg per meter square and here 150 kilonewton per meter square 150 okay guys so let me show you the other okay types of soil sorry types of soil and here bearing capacity in kilonewton per meter square okay because in kg i don't have so just i will write kilonewton in this column okay so the other one is loose loose gravel which is same 150 kilonewton okay per meter square and the other one is medium glay 
which is also 150 kN per meter square. Sorry, uh, loose gravel 250, sorry. 250 and medium clay also 250 kN. And mm, dry sand that is also 250 kN. Okay? Compact clay which is compact glass 450 kN per meter square and compact sand compact clay and compact sand which is also 450 kN and compact gravel which is also 450 kN and soft rock which is also 450 kN okay so guys uh, this is the topic for today safe bearing capacity of soil which i have discussed the front of you the capacity of soil which support the structure load to the soil without any shear failure or settlement now we have safe bearing capacity for different types of soil so types of soil in this side bearing capacity in kg per meter square and bearing capacity in kilonewton per meter square so these are the types soft wet muddy soft clay fine loose and dry which is this one black cotton soil moisture clay or sand uh, clay moisture okay the other one is loose gravel medium clay dry sand compacted uh, clay and compact sand compact gra uh, gravel and soft rock okay so different types of soil and its safe bearing capacity so before starting any building construction or any civil engineering structure you have to check uh, it's safe bearing capacity uh, uh, and after that you are able to start building construction if you don't check uh, safe bearing capacity of soil so you will face more problems in building construction because a uh, safe bearing capacity can also uh, show you the depth of foundation what should be the minimum depth of foundation for different types of building and depth of foundation is also depend on the sbc soil bearing capacity of soil if the bearing capacity of the soil is low so there we will uh, the depth of foundation should be maximum if the bearing capacity self bearing capacity of the soil is good or better so the depth of foundation should be less so especially uh, we have uh, specific formulas to find depth of foundation and those formulas are depend on the safe bearing capacity of soil and different types of soil its density also um, internal friction of soil etc okay so this is a topic which i have discussed the front of you safe bearing capacity so if you have any question related with this topic so you can comments i will try to reply your answer thanks for watching see you in next video goodbye